Megan Fox hunting for a girlfriend? Hey guys, today we're going to talk about how Megan Fox is hunting for a girlfriend. Let's get right into it. If you were a sapphic person, when you were growing up in the 2000s, which is an umbrella term for anyone who might identify with aspects of the lesbian community, it's likely that you were obsessed with Megan Fox. Because of the character's blood-sucking antics and the now iconic by affirming line, I go both ways, as well as the simmering sexual tension between her and her BFF, Anita, who was played by Amanda Seyfried, her eponymous role in the cult horror film Jennifer's Body is legendary among lesbians. Jennifer's Body is a film that has become a cult classic. Away from the spotlight, Megan has never been coy about the fact that she is bisexual. She first disclosed this information in an interview with Esquire in 2009 and went on to discuss the various female partners she has had in the past. In fact, she even celebrated Pride Month last year with a seriously iconic Instagram post in which she wore a neon rainbow manicure with the caption, putting the B in LGBTQIA for over two decades. Yes, she's a bicon for the ages, and her most recent Instagram post appears to be referencing that aspect of her identity and welcoming female romantic opportunities. She specifically shared a carousel of selfies as well as a short boomerang of herself in a car while wearing a fluffy hat and a strappy top. She then captioned the post with, Currently seeking a girlfriend, please submit applications in the DMs, prompting thirsty fans to go wild. At the time of writing, the post has been liked a whopping almost 3 million times. However, given Megan's current engagement to and PDA-filled relationship with Machine Gun Kelly, the post is probably a little confusing to some. Could these two have decided to open up about their relationship and join the growing list of polyamorous and non-monogamy celebrities? Should we interpret this as a sign that the two are no longer together? Well, among the many comments, one of the best came from her rapper-turned-rocker partner. MGK believes Fox lacks the fighting capacity to entertain the number of people who are interested in being her girlfriend. MGK wrote, I don't think you have the fighting capacity for this request. In some ways, the performer was correct. Megan Fox's post drew a flood of responses from hopeful applicants, both ordinary people and celebrities. Meanwhile, YouTuber and model Carly Bible said the spot has already been filled by herself. The influencer said, It's me. Hi. After all, MGK might have known what he was talking about. These are only a few of the thousands of comments on Fox's post, which has nearly 3 million likes. Based on this response, it appears that the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle star will require a more extensive filing system to work through these applications. Megan Fox and Machine Gun Kelly have quickly become a favorite Hollywood couple thanks in part to their unusual and occasionally bizarre love story. They share incredible fashion looks and make time to work on films together. It's nice to see MGK be supportive of his fiance, even when Fox is looking for a girlfriend. Fox's post comes after it appeared that she skipped the Kardashians' Christmas Eve party with MGK, which was hosted by the couple's friends Travis Barker and Kourtney Kardashian. However, the couple who wear bucket hats together stays together. After Fox recently took up the Muppet hat trend popularized by Rihanna, MGK stepped out recently with Fox while donning a furry white bucket hat, which his wife-to-be previously wore in October. Fox and Kelly previously stepped out at Milan Fashion Week in September, Kelly sporting a black bucket hat and Fox wearing one in red. They first met on the set of their crime thriller Midnight in the Switchgrass in 2020. They announced their engagement in January and the groom-to-be has since confirmed that friend Pete Davidson will be one of his groomsmen. Now, rumor has it that MGK and Megan Fox are expecting a child. The rapper-turned-rocker took the stage in Las Vegas to perform his song, Twin Flame, a not-so-subtle nod to Megan's belief that the lovebirds are two halves of the same soul. Before performing the track, he made a surprising announcement. I wrote this song for my wife. As if it wasn't enough to get people talking, near the end of his emotional performance, he followed up with, This is for our unborn child, as the sound of a heartbeat filled the room. After the show, MGK tweeted about the ballad, telling his 1.6 million followers that it broke his heart to sing the end of that song. He then tweeted, I recorded Twin Flames two years ago today. The second half came a year later, beautifully serendipitous getting to sing it for you tonight. During an interview with Entertainment Tonight, MGK revealed that he penned the song exactly two years before his performance at the BBMAs, and then he played it for his bow first. MGK recalled, I wrote this song two years ago exactly today. I played it for. It's all a trip. It's like it's all meant to be. He then said, Yeah, there's like a super special secret meaning to the song as well, so I'm sure it will be emotional. 
Now that MGK and Megan Fox have started planning their wedding, the groom-to-be has a distinct vision that will be difficult to realize, but I suppose we'll have to wait. That's all for today, and we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.